During the war, most of the Daimler-Benz manufacturing plants were destroyed. Production afterwards resumed with the proven model 170V, although at first, Americans only licensed repairing work on U.S. Army vehicles and the production of delivery vans, which were urgently needed for reconstruction. In May 1946, the first flatbed truck was produced, followed a month later by a delivery van. Ambulance and police cars extended the model range in autumn, and in July 1947, production of the four-door 170V sedan was resumed. In May 1949, the types 170D and 170S were presented, the first newly designed cars. The 170 was outstanding on account of its efficient 1.7 liter diesel engine, which even in those days burned clearly less fuel than its petrol-powered counterpart. The types 170V and 170D benefited from substantial makeovers in May 1950. To differentiate them from the originals, the improved versions were internally called 170VA and DA. Two years later, both models were modified again. Models 170VB and DB were fitted with widened rear axles, bumpers, and an enhanced windshield behind which the wiping mechanism was installed. Additionally, the louvers on the side of the hood were replaced by two horizontal strips. Production of the 170V and 170D continued until 1953. The continuing success of the model was mainly due to its efficient performance, reliability, and durability. <laughs>